And you can buy gold and silver ingots right from this vault that we're standing in. So, steel barred wall right here. Gold and silver ingots for sale outright right here. So he kept right at two million in this room, which would be 120 million in our money today for sale. Plus he wow. kept several 500 pound ingots of silver in this room as well. Wow. Why 500 pound ingots? That's an easy one. You should have no trouble with that question. <laughs> well, well, rephrase that again. <laughs> Why 500 pound ingots of silver? Well. Well, because they were easier to ship, I can imagine. I mean, I mean, if you had it by a certain size and weight, you would know what it was worth. It'd go from, from what I understand, 5 ounce up to 500 pound ingots. I've, ne I've never heard of a 500 pound ingot. I never had neither until I did my history. And I mean, I always thought that they were, you know, one pound a piece ingots and that's it, but... No, they went from, they went all different sizes. Wow. You know why. It's an easy one. Why 500 pound ingots? Nobody could steal it. There you go. <laughs> you carry a 500 pound ingot out to your horse, he's going to look at you and say, I'm not going to carry that. Are you crazy? Yeah. So now you got it. What do you do with it? Yeah, yeah I, just, I just had to ponder a few minutes about that and <laughs> think, wait a second. Yeah. <laughs> That's why. That's why 500 pound ingots. Wow. Couldn't carry them. This 